Good evening. Can you hear me? Gilberto. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Robert. How are you doing today? I right now, teacher, I I have a a lot of cough because today um combat the the call and I a little little very tired and for my throat. Oh, I understand. I'm really sorry to hear that. <clears throat> yes, the chat. Uh, have, have you I, been have you been taking? I'm sorry. Uh, for that reason, I am listening to the teacher. You will be as a listener. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> have you taken um medicines? Yes, teacher. Uh, uh, today in, in the afternoon, I I I took medicine and when I arrived to my my house, I I made the the medicine uh lemon with with honey and, mm -hmm. and ginger. Oh, okay, that is good. That will help you. I hope you get better. Thanks, teacher. <clears throat> Welcome. Um Rodrigo, Daniela. Hello, teacher. Hello. How are you doing? Are you sick or not? Are you okay? No, I'm okay. Okay, good. Be careful because uh, the weather is no, uh, well, According to the weather, right? So if you don't if you don't have a uh, good I don't know how to say that defenses. <laughs> so you Defense. can get yes, you can get sick because um a lot of illnesses with this kind of weather. For me it will be it will be good if I good. get a cold. And staying in my home some days. Ah. I prefer very much to, to do home, a home office ah, okay. than travel every day 33 kilometers to my office. I understand. But you have that option to work at home. Yeah, I have that option. But uh, it is not optional for you if you want to work, for example, two or three days from home and just go two days to the mm, office. Eh, before, about six, eight, eight months ago, but actually, no. Only if you are sick or maybe if the car is have some troubles or, mm. or maybe... Uh, actually, in my case, uh, some some ways to go to my office are closed or have troubles like uh, the rumbes mm -hmm. uh, or, or many other things. Okay. But I actually I prefer uh, one for a uh, one hundred percent to. To do my work here in my house. Yes. It is it is uh um a hundred percent, I can I say a hundred percent is better, right, than than going to work uh, to the office because you my my, my time work and money, yes. Uh-huh. My work and my position doesn't require to to stay in, in the office. So they, I, I can perfectly do my work uh, here in my house. I have no mm -hmm. problem of that. Mm -hmm. I understand. But your boss requires that you go to the office. Rodrigo, ah. I uh -huh. have a question for you. Where uh -huh. do you work? 
Where? In San Salvador. Oh my goodness, because I think you were in Adok. No, no, no. Adok is one customer of the company. Ah, okay. Okay, thanks. No, no problem. So, like two hours, you said, Rodrigo, to go to your home? Uh, actually, I, I'm i doing about um, between one hour, one hour, 15 minutes. Uh, it depends really in the traffic. Mm -hmm. uh, my ultimate routes uh, are uh, like to go to La Integración and then go to La Troncal del Norte or uh, Road to La Gloria. Mm -hmm. But uh, my my base time is about one hour, one hour fifteen, one one hour twenty minutes, and when I go back to to here to my house, um, yeah, one hour, one hour fifteen. It it really really depends on the traffic. Mm -hmm. When there are no traffic, uh, easily forty five minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay, but yes, it's a lot of time mm -hmm. driving. Mm -hmm. Rodrigo, where do you live and where do you work exactly, man? I'm working, my work, my, well, the office, the name is Cyprus, and it is placed in La Rabida. No, no, no. Where, where do you live? Oh, that is taking place in La Rabida, and where do you live? Ah, I'm here. I live here in Ciudad Marsella, in Opico. Ciudad Marsella. Uh -huh. That's horrible, man. Yeah, I understand you. Uh, yeah, when when there are traffic, it, it is a trouble. You have a stress, but with no traffic, it's easily to come here or thirty go minutes, to, right? Uh, forty-five minutes. Forty-five minutes. Approximately forty-five, forty minutes. It depends. Uh, my uh, my march it's about uh, 100 kilometers per hour but um, you you uh, how do you say te acostumbras you get used to you get used to um, actually i have no problem for me when there are no traffic i I uh, I use my time to to I don't know maybe hear at podcast, hear mm -hmm. music, mm -hmm. uh, on, only go concentrate uh, driving. Oh, I, I take my time. Mm -hmm. I have no problem on that. The problem is the 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 traffic. The problem is the, the people in the motorcycles who who do the the third uh, way. I, I really hate that. I, I really hate that. And the and maybe a, a, an accident on try to make the traffic, but uh, except of that, I have no problem. Mm -hmm. really? I really like to live here because the security uh, well, this place really quiet. Uh, you have peace, you have a peaceful place here. Okay, that is good. Really yeah. good. Okay, I this understand. is yes. This is how do you how you say um the rumba, Rodrigo? Landslide. Land landslide. Uh -huh. A landslide. landslide. Uh -huh. uh, the landslide usually are in the los chorros. Los chorros, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, really good. Well, um. Guys, take care of yourself, okay? Uh, try to avoid illnesses because we were saying at the beginning that uh, this weather um, brings a lot of illnesses, right? So try to take care of your family and yourself, okay? If your okay. body has a good defense system, so you will support. Uh, maybe you don't get sick, right? But if you don't, so there are more probabilities that you can get sick. Okay, really good. So we're going to start today. Let me see. Today is Wednesday. 
October 18, 2023. We're going to continue working in the unit two. We're going to continue speaking about this in a product. We are, we have a writing uh, exercise at the end. At the end of this class, you will be able to, to organize a basic plan to run a focus group to test a product or um, think about how to test it, okay? Okay, first, I, I have this uh, transitions worth, that is the name. When we write a paragraph, when we write an essay, so we'll start thinking, uh, trying to order the ideas, okay? So the ideas that go first, the, the ideas that go next, okay? And so on. So today we're going to um, complete the correct words, okay? The, the transitions words that you make use when you are writing. Okay. Try to think what will be that transition word. First. 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 <laughs> Very easy. Okay. Okay. Good. That is the transition word. First. Uh huh. What about this one? Come on, teacher. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Uh huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Tell us. Second. Second. Okay. Very good. Very easy. Okay. Next. Cheers. There. 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 Very easy. Oh, this. No. P H P H I I I uh -huh. R D R D. Okay, good. What about this one? For for. Okay, we have forward. an order. It's, for uh, tell me the spelling. F O U U. R R T H T H fourth. Okay. Now next. 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 Okay. Next. Uh-huh. Mm. Then. 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 Okay. Right. Finally. Finally. Wow. Okay. okay. Good. Possible words that we can use to order the ideas in a paragraph, okay? So those are called transitions <clears throat> words, okay? So we are going to use them today because today we're going to write a paragraph. I'll try to use all of them, okay? Let me see the chat. Julio is driving. Wow. From San Vicente to La Unión. Oh. Okay. It's okay, Julio. Okay. Um, let me continue. Okay, we're going to continue today. Do you remember your podcast that you... <laughs> Other podcast is... <laughs> <laughs> that you recorded yesterday. No, we, we didn't finish to ah, listen all yeah. of them. So okay. we're going to finish today to listen all of them. So the one that I'm missing, you can upload it in the chat. 
I remember Gabby. I don't know if you finished, Gabby. You yes, were you that. I don't send the, 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 the audio. I didn't receive the audio. So you haven't recorded yet? No? No, teacher. I, I write. Only write the, 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 you the podcast. You have the but... written part. Mm -hmm. Okay, once that you are able to record the audio, you, you do it, okay? And send it. Okay. We want okay. to listen to you. Okay, okay, we are, you. We're Thank going you. to listen. It's okay. We're going to listen again, uh, Leticia. Okay. Just to give you the feedback, Leticia. We we're pending from yesterday. Okay, pay attention. If you have also feedback, you can provide feedback to her. Okay. Or questions. You can ask questions. Good evening, class. On this occasion, I come to introduce you to the use of wireless hearing aids. New everyday use. Nowadays, the fact that we have made technology a fundamental part of our life, whether we communicate in for ourselves or carry out texts of various kings has led to numerous technological products appearing on the market every day. These are items that arrive ready to meet needs that we have. A clear example can now be seen in the boom that wireless headphones have experienced, which facilitate communication behind being ours and free to be able to do another activity at the same time. Whether we make a phone call or listen to music, all this without overlooking other similar items, such as a smartwatch and the numerous set of applications that have come to the market and that make it much easier for you to carry out any type of activity, both professional and entertainment. Due to their every nature, technology products evolve very quickly, making models absolute in a short time. That's why technology products are constantly evolving. Okay, good. Do you have questions for Letty? Uh, no, 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 teacher. Why she is not here? No, she has problems with the. She has a, a serpent inside the house. Really? Yes. A snake. snake. Uh, oh, let me see this. She sharing in the WhatsApp group. Okay. Terrible. Okay. Um yes, it was a really good uh podcast. Um I identify some words so we can um well if she's if she watched this uh, class later so she can see this. I can see at the same time, okay? So that was mispronounced such as also much easier okay that is another phrase that she has to improve when she also says number numerous application she said so that case is plural that will be applications okay and another word was absolute absolute 
Okay, but she's improving, I can see. That is good. Okay, uh, let me see. We receive another one. Um, oh, we have Gabriela's, but first we're going to listen to Rodrigo, Carlos, and, and Gilberto. Okay, this last uh, nine minutes, so pay attention. <laughs> a big lounge yeah. well then uh, hello Gilberto hello Carlos how are you hi Rodrigo hello Rodrigo hello Gilberto. everyone I hope you are alright uh, well uh, in this we are going to try to make a podcast about uh, the product of Gilbertus told us about the cash seed. Uh, so uh, Gilberto, can you tell us a little bit more about this product, please? Gilberto, are you there? Yes, I am. Okay, Gilberto. So, uh, try to, to explain us uh, a little bit more about uh, this uh, cash seeds, uh, the product, or maybe how we can, uh, I don't know, maybe make the mark it make the marketing for the for the customers in this case uh, yeah uh, the cashier uh, the the product uh, the client i need uh, uh, ex, uh, exim, by uh, come on, more products that the quality cashier uh, total and cashier crude no sé cómo se y cashier mix eh, o sea when when if you want to try to say uh, the cash is crudo it is raw Raw, no. raw, raw, raw cash it, uh huh, and and yeah, and you say it. the cash it toast in this case tostada. Okay, mm -hmm. then the cash it rolls uh, uh, the uh, the testing the product the customer uh, pay in the four dollar or five dollar. Mm -hmm. The cashier tosta, tosta the trays uh, the $8. Okay. And $8. The cashier. The raw seed. Uh, crudo. Raw seed. $6 and $7. Uh, and the other problem uh, uh, that may I need problem uh, for the uh, the fruits uh, uh, a little a little problem in the country and I yeah I need product uh, uh, the client I need uh, for prey on uh, uh, advance uh, mm -hmm. the, the, uh, a major uh, tractor in, uh, intestinal uh, intestinal uh, uh, properties 
Okay, hey, that is interesting, Gilberto. And you, Carlos, eh, what do you think, or maybe you have a suggestion for us to make the marketing of the product? I don't know, eh, in social media, web page, or something. Maybe you have a, an idea on that. Yes, thank you, Rodrigo. Uh, I think that's first uh, we need to uh, to do a uh, investigation about the market for the people that uh, they have a diet uh, because they have uh, looking for something healthy and so this cashew tea is a very nice option to instead uh, the fat food you know and they and we need to or we, we can offer a different food uh, instead to fat food right so uh, maybe this market a big a big attack obviously with social media and uh, for example uh, instead to fat food you mm -hmm. can eat a touch a seal but it's a, a, a healthy food right, right. so uh, have a, a lot of properties uh, uh, and maybe uh, fat and i don't know uh, 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 all, uh, all property that you have to help uh, alimentation what you, your body okay that that's a good option a natural option so uh, the the main ideas from gilberto and the the way you want to make the marketing uh, carlos it is so good uh, so uh, i don't know gilberto if you want to add another some uh, another thing uh, or maybe we can close the this podcast but you can tell us uh, i see in the book uh, a very interesting uh, for diffusion of the products or all or at the customer uh, 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 I why uh, 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 increase the sell the product um, uh, uh, a major uh, um, a major client to my to a major clients yeah. Uh, for the season, the uh, uh, one moment the the, the finished production, uh, uh, the uh, finished product the year, uh, uh, I produce I uh, new uh, pro, a product new uh, uh, next year. Uh, for for Mars, uh, uh, you offer the product the the, the cashier. Okay. Well then, the guys, uh, with this, with all the info, we are going to finish this podcast. Thank you very much for the opinions, for the main idea, and well then, take care of you. Thank you. Thank you, Rodrigo. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. 
sorry, we were here. Okay, good. Excellent job, Rodrigo. So you were the one that were um um presenting the podcast. That was really good. Uh just I have one word. Okay, this one. Natural. Repeat that one, Rodrigo. Natural. 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 Yes, only that. Natural. Thank you so much. Okay, Gilberto. In your case, Gilberto, uh, remember that um, we need to organize the ideas first. So if you consider that help you, you can organize the ideas writing them, okay? And then you take your, your written ideas as a guideline to uh, speak about the topic. That will help you a lot. Okay. okay. Yes, to avoid that. Um, so you say a Spanish word at the same time that you are trying to speak in English. It, it means that you are trying to think in Spanish, right? To avoid that, you can organize them by writing and then just have them uh, as a guide to, to speak. Okay. Okay. Um, and work also in pronunciation. Okay. So that is what we need to to pay attention, pronunciation, and how to structure the ideas. I feel that there are some words that that you know, but you you don't complete them. Okay, um, that is why it is a little difficult, right, to understand everything that you said, but. You are doing a good job, okay? You are in the process of learning, I know, but try to to focus on your witnesses to improve your level, okay? Okay. Good. And Carlos, really good job. So that was a good um, podcast. I like it. So we're going to continue now with... Um, Lady. So Lady and Mauricio Buruca, but I can see that just Lady is book here. But listen to her. Hello, everyone. In this occasion, I talk about the best smartphone. This is the smartphone Guanakiro. Specifications. Software version 18.8. Model name. Guanakiro. 503 capacity 512 gigabyte bluetooth compatible with any device waterproof ways to load it wireless charger battery <coughs> and solar energy you can walk up to three numbers in the same cell Take advantage and purchase at super price. Remember that quarantine up to one year. Okay. Solar energy. So we'll be charged with this. Um, yes. Some. <laughs> okay. <laughs> really good. Who want that? Do you want the, the cell phone? phone. The cell phone in my drinks. <laughs> okay. The ecological res resource. Yes, that will be good. Okay. Retype the charge. Yes. And you will have three numbers, three phone numbers, different mm -hmm. uh, companies. <laughs> so you can have Claro, Tigo. Digicel, Digicel, all of them. <laughs> okay. Okay, that was good. Thank you, lady. Let me see. Okay, we have the last one that is Gabriela's. Okay, we're going to listen to Gabriela. 
Hello everyone, welcome to your podcast. Now talking about the innovate product called Toby, created with artificial intelligence, a technology product to help to people could be a daily task assistant helping us with the artificial intelligence. This new product will be called Toby. <laughs> it will connect to all the device with Bluetooth and that will share the same Wi-Fi network and the functions it will have will be number one daily remembers uh, helping to people with the memory problems and having order in their task number number two shopping list of things to buy it is very necessary because if we forget to write them down we call use this tool and to be able to write a shopping list for us and send it to our phone number three do many tasks for us for example emergency calls identify and dangerous uh, sounds so we can call the scene that they contact and it may ha have many more functions as it is development more will be added but the ideas is to help people and for this assistant to be on the uh, for a price price <laughs> thank you and bye okay good do you have questions about that device ask her she's the the the, the one that created uh, she is speaking about the uh, earphone or or maybe uh-huh, Gabby. You call it Toby, right? Uh Toby is a dispositivo. Uh -huh, it is a device. Device. Gabriela. Yeah. What else can you tell us about your device? What else? Gabby? I guess she is having problems with the microphone. Yesterday was having issues. Okay. But she told me yesterday that her idea was like a create an Alexia, similar, right, with Alexia. But in this case, so uh, this device, this product will help you to remember things that you have to do. Um, For example, she said daily... Uh, routines that you have to do or daily tasks that you have to do, right? That device will tell you what you have to do, this, the time that you have to do it. And also a shopping list. Uh, you don't have to do your shopping list manually. So that device will remind you what you need to buy, what you don't have in your house. Mm -hmm. uh, also, she's... Me yes? Uh, maybe teacher, this device remember all the schedule routine. Uh huh. Maybe. Yeah, that is the idea. Okay, there are three words that she has to improve. Uh, when she mentioned create, but it should be past tense that is created. Okay. Also, she mentioned identify. Um but I didn't hear the correct pronunciation. Identified and affordable, okay? Affordable means that you can pay it for it, right? You can pay that device. So it means that it will be uh, not really expensive. That will be uh, affordable for everyone. Okay, good. What uh, mean affordable, affordable? That you can pay for it. Uh, it's not too much. Uh, 
how do you spell a, a photo? Okay, let me Can you see my dictionary here? It's double F. Ah, affordable. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Thank you, teacher. Ah, affordable. Not expensive, you see? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Price that you can Affordable. that you can pay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Good. So I like your podcast. Really good job. Okay, everyone. We're going to do more. <laughs> okay. So one day maybe. We're going to do like a TV show or video, okay? But you have really? to record it. Like a TikTok dish. Uh huh. No, no, like a TikTok. That would be better than like a ah, TikTok. TikTok. <laughs> okay. okay. Let me see. Okay. I have questions. We're going to continue speaking about product. So, is there a way to predict? If your product will be accepted by con consumers, what do you think? For example, if you the the product that you created yesterday, so what is your prediction about that? Mm -hmm. Oh, let me see. If we are missing someone here. From Gabby and Lady, well. Teacher. Mm -hmm. It will be a Sussex. That will be? Uh, a success. Successful, uh -huh. Suc Success. Yes, because uh, we think that these products uh, is a healthy food. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Good. So that is your prediction. Really good. So would you like to be a product tester? Si a ustedes les gustaría ser parte de ese grupo de personas that test the product. Would you like to be a product tester? Yes. Yes? yes. Which product? The ones that we mentioned before in the in the previous podcast. Uh, Gilberto, help me. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we mentioned different the... products. So remember the one that presented yesterday, Roberto. Roberto presented a mouse. That will be in your hand. Um. Okay, Gab Gabriela presented a Toby device. She called it Toby. Uh, let me remember. Maria Leticia presented earphones. Lady presented a cell phone. Right, and you, your team, uh, Rodrigo and Carlos presented. Um, cash it seat. Cash it seat. Cash it seat. Mm -hmm. Okay, which product would you like to test if you are part of the product tester team? In my case, the cash it seat. Okay. In my case, <laughs> teacher, the Toby device. The Toby device, uh huh. Yes. Good. Green a club. Okay. <laughs> they remind me the all thing that I like to do. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, and who else? Another volunteer? Gilberto, what about you? Which product would you like to test? Yeah. In my case, I think uh, 
the product, the lady, the cell phone, the, the Zoom. Okay. Yeah, the cell phone, the uh, energy Zoom. And, and that was solar uh, energy, uh -huh. the one that is charged with the sun. Okay. Uh, what about you, Andres? Are you available? Andres? Yes, it's here. I'm here. Okay. Yes, uh, and here. which was? I'm sorry, I have problems with the microphone. Okay, no problem. Did you work yesterday, Hello? Andres? Yes, right. Yes, teacher, but with... when in the last in the last part with Kathy, but we have the problem that the in the video doesn't or didn't record the voice, just ah, the video. I remember. Can you tell us a little bit about your product? Yeah, I remember my part, teacher, mm -hmm. but I don't know if Kathy is available. Or we can we can mention our podcast. We can we can share our podcast later. It's okay. Just mention the name of the product. Well, we don't we don't put an we don't we don't you put don't a, have name a name from yeah we don't have a name but it's an application for change the language. App. Okay. Yes, yeah, it is an app. Yeah. Um, so it is a translator. For application, yeah, it's like a translator. Yeah, and the thing is, uh, the basic thing is, for example, if I am a North American people and I want to talk with a Salvadorian, the application changed my language from Spanish. Or, for example, if I am uh, from another country and I want to talk with uh, another people in another country, of course, and the the application changes from my own language. For example, if I if I speak in Spanish, I I can hear the things that the other share with me or talk to me, but in my own language. Mm -hmm. in, for video call, call yeah for video call. Oh. So in the same moment that the other people talk to me, it's like Zoom. It's like we make a video call, um, so the application changes automatically the 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 language. So okay. I hear the, the the words in my own language, and the other people um, listen the same thing. <laughs> the the words in the in the in the same they, language in the, their language. Yeah. Their native language. Okay. Um, Good. Yes, uh, well, that will be a nice application. Okay. Okay. Uh, and what kind of product would you like to test, Andres? Your application or other product? I think that my application, teacher, because okay. uh, it's innovate for the work. It's possible okay. that the can change that no no everybody that can speak very well uh, some language can talk with another people that is in other other country. Okay, good. What about you? Thank you, Andres. What about you, lady? What kind of uh product would you like to test? Lady, are you there, lady? Okay, Julio and Mauricio are as a listener only. Okay, what about you, Sofia? Are you there? Teacher, yes, yes, I'm there. Yes. What kind of product would you like to test? I think that 
uh, I want to know about the new apps because the one one of the uh, the apps are the uh, and useful for get products, but some ones don't know how can use. And if I have experience to test it, I could learn about it. Okay, so Andres app, that is the one that would that uh, would you like to test? Correct. Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you. Nancy, are are you available? Nancy. Gabriela. Hello, teacher. Hello. Yes. Um, what kind of product, the ones that we have been speaking before that your classmate have presented, what kind of product would you like to test? Um, the product tester or... Okay, we spoke about a mouse, your your device that was Toby, earphones, cell phone, a ca cash seed, and also an application that was created by, by Andres. So we have all that product. What kind of product would you like to test? Um, I think that um, my product or Toby is... Oh, your product. Uh -huh. Okay, we were asking you, I don't know what problems that you have with your microphone that you didn't listen to us or what happens, I don't know. Uh, but you tell us a little bit more about your product. So Carlos wanted to hear more information about that. Excuse me, teacher. No, I, I am asking Gabriela to explain more about her product. Ah, okay, okay. Gabby? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Ask her, G Carlos. What was your question uh, about the topic? Yes, yes. Uh, Device Toby uh, use battery or or is uh plug and play the core and the ener energy with energy is a uh, connection direct connection in the electricity I think mm -hmm. okay uh which ones the function uh, it's the device, Toby. They help um they help the people to remember things, the task or list, uh, shopping, or the the weather, <laughs> uh, or the time. You can tell or. Or you can say somewhere else uh, that uh, to Toby and it helped you to the remember things. Okay. Uh, uh, can I move on the, this device to my office or, or only to my my home in at home at home i think it's better in at home or uh, i i thinking of, about the the assistant uh, mobile you can mm -hmm. take the the mm, the aparato, no sé cómo se dice aparato. Device. <laughs> device. Device. Uh, and you can uh, go to the 
more places. It will be connected to your cell phone, right? Right, right. But uh, uh, the the connection with the electricity uh, will be with the power plant. Mm -hmm. What are the measurements of the device? Measurement. Measurement. Huh? Measurement. Mm -hmm. Weight, um, large or weight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Measurement. I don't know. <laughs> Las medidas. Oh, like a cell phone or very small, the cell phone is like, um, um, I don't know, bocina. <laughs> ah, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. It's like a bocina portátil. Yes, speaker. a little, a little speaker. speaker. Mm -hmm. mm, okay. 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 Good. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Gabriela. Thank you, okay. Carlos. <laughs> okay. You're welcome. Let me see who is who else we have available. Okay, Cindy is listener today. Robert is listener today. Nancy is listener. Uh, Julio also is listener. Um, okay, let me see. Rolando, Danilo, are you available? Rolando? No? Okay, Kathy, listener. Gilberto, okay, is participating. Lady, are you there, lady? Lady. Hello, Miss. Yes, I was I was calling you before. I was asking what is your favorite product? What which product would you like to test? Mm. Um, el de María Leticia. The earphones. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. And me convenció. Me... <laughs> Sorry, lady. Me convenció con el podcast. Ah, okay. <laughs> Good. Daniela, are you available? Oh, no. Daniela is a listener, too. Wow. How many people do we have as a listener today? Okay. Um, let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. From, from 16, we have eight listeners. Okay. Well, well, uh, thank you so much for the ones that are participating, okay? That you do it every day. Good. Let me see. Um, well, let me continue. We have here a part a conversation. I need volunteers to read this conversation. It is an example how we can use the, the words that we saw at the beginning in the first activity, the transition words we have here. Son of them. Okay, Carlos, thank you so much. Who else wants to participate? Lady. Okay, Carlos and Lady, go ahead. Okay, uh, I am Moises. Mm -hmm. uh, you are Fernanda. Okay, uh, have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect a cure results. We will work with targeted, targeted or random samples. In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go 
for a random sample. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, uh, so we work work on it. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Focus. Repeat that, Carlos. Focus. Fo Focus. 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 To avoid Is to it? say another Focus. word that uh, we can confuse. Okay, try to pronounce. Uh, <laughs> try to pronounce. Or it's make a bad emphasis. word. It is. <laughs> Try to make, to make emphasis on uh, uh, how to pronounce that specific word, okay? Thank you so much. Yes, do you have questions? What means furthermore, teacher? Furthermore uh, means uh, además. Uh, it's like a connector. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Furthermore. It is a transition word. In addition, right? It is similar to that one. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Carlos and Lady. Okay, Andres and Rodrigo. Okay, Rodrigo, you will be Moises and Andres will be Fernando. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of a last less 24 participants to collect accurate results. Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss uh, who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random simple sample. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Okay, this word. How do you pronounce that? Well, uh... Andres, this one. Sure, uh, at least. Least? At no, least. Least, at least. Uh, at least, okay. At least. least. At least. least. Okay. okay, really good. Okay, according to the conversation, what is a focus group? What do you think? Mm -hmm. Teacher is uh, maybe research method. It is on a specific group of people, right? For example, it could be in a class, it could be in uh, the university, maybe one specific group of students in a subject. Also, it could be uh, for a specific age of a population so the product is will be for adults so you can select the age right or if the product will be just for teenagers so you can focus your group <coughs> teenagers only so it will depends of the kind of product that you want to test that will be your focus group for example, if I want to test a product with you, right? All, all of you, you will be my focus group. Okay. Do you have questions? No? Any other uh, volunteers?
Okay, Gilberto and Sofia, go ahead. Gilberto, you will be Moises. Sofia will be Fernanda. Okay. Have you any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Sure, Moises. We will have a three group of at least 24 participants to collect cure results. We will work with target and random samples. In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group in the location of each. You are right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go to random sample. For more, it is necessary to create will design a questionnaire to get the specific information required. Are your main locals today in the afternoon to working or to working egg? So we work on it. She working on it. So, so we, work we work on it. Okay, so we work on it. Mm -hmm. Okay, try to take your time to read all the words, all the sounds. Furthermore, repeat this. Furthermore. Okay. Sign it. Sign it. Okay, let me see. Target it. Target it. Participants. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, according to that uh conversation, how many how many focus group will participate in the test? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. How many? Uh, I think the chat is only one group. Three, three groups. Three groups. Three three groups. groups. Three groups. Yeah, three groups. Three groups. So yes. What type of sample has Fernanda selected for the testing process? Mm hmm. Monitoring. In addition, focus groups. Mm. With targeted target or, random. or random. random. Okay. Mm. Mm. Yes. Who will decide the questionnaire? Lucas. A specific information. No, who? Who will decide it? Um, Moises and I think Lucas. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They will do it. They will work together on it. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Now we're going to see a little bit about transitions of addition words. Okay. Transitions words like a, in, addi in addition, furthermore, moreover, and besides. Add information, reinforce ideas, and express agreement with ideas that have been presented previously. For example, we have in the sentence here. We will... We work with targeted or random sa samples. This is the question. Then we introduce this. In addition, comma, we need to discuss who will be hosting each group and the location of each. Okay. We have another example. Furthermore, it is necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get a specific information we require. Okay. Another example, in order to select a focus group, the test 
to test a product, it is important to gather a group of participants who make direct use of the final product or service. Moreover, okay, it is necessary to choose a moderator for every group. Punctuation, okay? So be careful with punctuation. I always I always ask, uh, say that be careful with punctuation. Um, notice that the transition in addition, and furthermore, and A and B examples here are preceded by a question mark and a period, and the following by comma. Okay. In C, in the example of C, the transition yeah, moreover wow. is preceded by a semicolon and followed by a comma. Okay, it's preceded here. Then we have a semicolon, punto y comma. After the word, there is a comma. Okay. The transition to separate two ideas with a period question mark plus transition or with a semicolon plus transition is a matter of personal style. Okay? Yes, it's a matter of personal writing style. So different um, people can write different ways. I cannot tell you that there is just one specific way to write, right? Because there are different ways to do it. So you have your styles, uh -huh. but also uh, you need to think that in the different ways that you do it needs to be acceptable, okay? Or understandable. That other person can understand what you say, what you are trying to express in your written words. Enjoy, Rodrigo. <laughs> it's okay that is the idea mm -hmm. that is the idea okay that what no, you are writing chocolate. is clear mm -hmm. oh, okay, it's chocolate. okay excuse me <laughs> mm -hmm. a big bowl <laughs> a, cup. a big cup for a small boy <laughs> 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 yes it's a pot of milk Questions, guys, that you have about transitions, words? The teacher is name is transition word. Transitions. Why transition? Because um, you use them to organize your ideas. Uh, 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 the there are three uh, sentences, uh, uh, yes, word. So, uh, all means uh, the same. It's, all of them are called It's the like same. this. Mm -hmm. In addition, for the more is equal. It's in addition, moreover, equal to. Yes. In addition means uh, que le voy a agregar algo más, ¿verdad? Le agrego algo más, adiciono algo más. Okay, uh -huh, furthermore, yes. eh, lleva la misma idea, que es, es similar, que okay, si usted uh -huh. ya, re, por ejemplo, usted ya mencionó esta en su párrafo, usted ah, quiere okay. volver a decirlo, pero no quiere repetir la misma. Usted, furthermore. Furthermore. Ah, uh, okay. Or moreover, that is other way to say, además. Okay, um, in the other paragraph above, uh, I can use moreover. The idea is not repeat the not repeat the additional same because, or more. Yeah, avoid to repeat repetitions. Stop, oh, try to oh. avoid repetitions. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. And according to your idea, so if, for example, in your paragraph, uh, you want to have a sequence, quiere tener una secuencia, right? You can use the ones that we saw at the beginning first, second. Third, so you, you can enumerate all the ideas in that way. 
in a vision is fear, quarter more is second, maybe, and uh, whatever is number three. It or depends. tears. It depends your um your way to 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 write this the ideas, right? Mm -hmm. so just try to I uh, use to use an appropriate word to introduce the next idea. Mm -hmm. Okay. Como les decía, hay muchas formas de, de escribir las mismas ideas. No necesariamente tienen que escribir igual, ¿verdad? Todos, porque cada quien escribe. Depende de su creatividad, depende de lo que usted piensa. Entonces, ah, no importa que lo escriban de diferente manera, pero que se entienda, que el, el reader, quien lo está leyendo, puede entender bien sus ideas. Y no pierda, o sea, que no pierda a la persona que está intentando leerlas. That is the main idea, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. Ok, teacher. Good. If you don't have questions about this, we're going to continue. We're going to move on. And now we're going to practice how to use these uh, transitions words. <laughs> You are going Teacher, to write. Yes, Carlos. Excuse me. This transition word, uh, for example, in addition or furthermore, is sequence to a uh, question. Or in other words, is when the uh, use mm, can. No necessarily. No nece Aquí, mm -hmm. porque da el ejemplo en el párrafo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero no necesariamente tiene que ir antes de, después de una, de una pregunta. pregunta. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Okay. ok. ok, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Now, based on the product that we have created the previous class, that the one that you created the, post, the podcast, you are going to write a paragraph about advantages and disadvantages of implementing a focus group to test the product. Use the transitions of additions and the fo and follow with advantages and disadvantages. For example, here we have here the examples about disadvantages and advantages. So <clears throat> you are going to work based on base your product. Okay, uh, I'm going to give you the option if you want to work together in the same group that you were working and develop one paragraph, all of you. So you can share your ideas and write one paragraph, okay? You can use any tool to write a paragraph. You can use uh, Gamba, uh, P PowerPoint or Word, any tool that you want to use will be okay. Let me join the groups. Do, do you agree to work the same group? Because you have the ideas, right? Yeah, Tisha. Yes, okay. Now you are going to express your ideas using transition words in a written form, okay? Now it's not a podcast, it will be a paragraph. Okay, let me create the, um, the teams. <clears throat> okay, let me see, Carlos and Rodrigo, you were working together. Carlos. Rodrigo and Gilberto, correct? We're working together. And yes, then, sure. yes, lady, did you work with Mauricio, right? But Mauricio, I don't know if Mauricio is available now. Mauricio? No. Mm -mm. Do you want to work with Gabriela, lady? So you can select one of your products. So your product or Gabriela's product. 
Okay, miss. Okay, I'm going to add Gabby to your group. Okay, Andres. Who was Hello, your partner? Teacher. Hello, teacher. Hi, Gabriela. Hi, hi. Kathy, right? Kathy, are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay. Because I'm not sure, please remove the word oyente because I get confused. Let me see, okay. Kathy. Then, Robert, are you able to work this activity because you don't have to speak? Robert? Hello, teacher. Mm -hmm. Uh, do you send the the link for the of the platform for write the paragraph? No, no, you it, that will be optional. You can use anyone. Okay, okay, and I read add... the paragraph. The paragraph. Okay, who was your partner, Robert? Uh, Maria Leticia, right? Yes, Maria Leticia. But she's yes, not right. here. Let me see. <clears throat> Let me see. Mm. Sophia, are you available, Sophia? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes. Okay, yesterday you were not available, right? You didn't work on that. Yes, I have a uh, meeting with me. Okay, so I'm going to join you uh, to Roberto's teams because our realities is not available, so you can provide ideas to Robert, okay? Okay. Okay, and the rest, I guess they are not available. Please let me know if you are available because um, I see all of you as uh, listeners. Okay, let me open the rooms. Sophia, I have ready a request, send a request to join to room four, where is Robert? Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm.
Hello, lady. Hi, Miss. Yes, you did you request help? I saw your message. Sí, es que estaba conectada, pero creo que Gavin no se ha dado cuenta. Que tiene el micrófono encendido. Gabriela. Hola, hola. Hola, Gaby. Hello, teacher. Hi. Hi. Are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay. So, ustedes pueden trabajar juntas, uh, pueden elegir un, un producto, puede ser el de Lady o el suyo, Gabriela, y de eso va a ser el párrafo. Ok. ¿Párrafo y luego hay que grabar o solo párrafo? Solo párrafos. Ok. Ok. Using the, uh, the words that I, um, that were in the previous conversation, transition words. That is the one that you're going to use. For example, in addition, furthermore, moreover, besides. Okay, first, second. So any word that you consider that is appropriate to use in your in your paragraph, that is that you're going to try to use them, okay? Okay. Yes. You can speak about Toby device or you can speak about uh cell phone, ladies' cell phone. Lady cell phone, I think, may because the, the the my product I I I think is my complicate more, more complicated. complicated. Yes, it's okay. so a product in in development. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's okay, okay, lady. So you can present the specifications to Gabriela, and you can start working on it. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Hola, Gabriela. Hello, lady. <laughs> Yo no te estaba Gabi, Gabriela, Gabi. <laughs> Yo no te lo que me escuche. Hola, <laughs> Gabriela, ya callaste. <laughs> <laughs> y lo que yo hice fue bajarme un poquito de volumen. La indicación, la indicación era escribe un párrafo de 10 líneas sobre las ventajas y desventajas de implementar un grupo para probar un producto utilizando las transiciones de suma y, la, en la, y las siguientes ventajas y desventajas. Y unos ejemplos serían eh, desventaja no hay suficientes estereotipos en, en la audiencia seleccionada, sin considerar los, los principiantes sean parte de la lengua meta, eh, pero ese es el ejemplo. Eh, uh -huh. ya en nuestro caso, podríamos decir ¿va? que una de las ventajas es que por ser un producto nuevo no hay suficientes eh, devices en, en el mercado. Uh, por ser un producto accesible, también podríamos tener este, una competencia. Ah, pues podría ser una desventaja. Y otra de las ventajas es de que es relativamente barato. Tiene una uh -huh. variedad de opciones. Eh, es un equipo que está con toda la tecnología y donde tú te, te has podido deshacer del mouse tradicional. Entonces, uh -huh. si, si gusta, le vamos dando forma ya ahí a la, a la, al párrafo. De acuerdo. Ok. Hello, teacher. Hello. Um, this paragraph is, is together as a team. Or, yes, or together. Is in the... No, 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 together. Together. Ah, yes, okay. Sofia can help you to give you ideas how to develop the, the paragraph. Yes, uh, I I I talk we are talking about the the postcard we we made yesterday. Mm -hmm. It's about advice of computer. It's mm -hmm. a new product in the market. Um and he, he has a 
a several several benefits, several options. He, he has a, a good technology. Okay, good. Yes, try okay. to, to express the ideas in a written form using the transition words, adding disadvantages and advantages. Okay, uh, only have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, this this paragraph, paragraph uh, we can write at Word or, or other platform? Any platform that you want. So if you want to use Word, it's okay. If you want to use Power Pro, PowerPoint, it's okay. If you want to use Canva, it's okay. Any other uh, tool that you want to use, it's okay. No problem. Okay. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. Oh, okay, Sophia, what do you think about the, the platform for, for this paragraph? And Canvas maybe could be a better. Okay. Uh, I, I agree. Uh, you can use one advantage is include a, a mm, reduce a cost effectiveness. Como que reduce reduce este los costos. Mm -hmm. The cost of the product. One advantage is reduce the cost of the product. Pero tenemos que hacer un conector. I know. Se mueve esta cosa. So remember, you can product. use any tool. Andres, any tool that you want to use to create a paragraph is okay. I already activated. In order you can share the screen if you want. Okay, teacher. Sí, porque ahorita estoy trabajando en a en a en PowerPoint. Okay. Sí, lo sí, quiero ver. Pantalla. Okay. Entonces una sería este este what advantage to reduce the cost of the product, como que reduce el costo del producto. O reduce los costos, porque mm -hmm. Sí. Esa sería una advantage. Sí. Eh, es una desventaja porque como dice usted es caro, ¿verdad? Usted compra una libre maní, un dólar, versus una semilla de marañón, 10, 9 dólares, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. De hecho, don, don Gilberto, hay unas bolsitas que venden, que creo que son importadas, ¿verdad? De semilla sí, sí, de marañón, que... que bueno, una vez me costó como $2.70. Sí, eh... hay, hay una empresa, bueno, yo trabajé en ella, se llama Grupo Alza, ¿verdad? De Guatemala, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. él, él le distribuye a los supermercados, ve a todas las gasolineras. Ah, ok. Es producto muy bueno. Y como usted sí. dice, ahí sí es cara la presentación del producto ese, ¿verdad? No es cara. como el artesanal de El Salvador, ¿verdad? Sí, Se cara. Es una bolsita china, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, cara y súper bueno. Sí, bien elaborada. Uh -huh. Teacher, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Oh, okay. Just listening excuse, to you. I don't want to. Me, I don't want to interrupt. Ah, okay, teacher. Thank you. So, 
eh, what other vale, miren, disadvantages? Hay, 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 hay tres uh, specific and scarce product, expensive seed against others, like peanuts and other. Esto, ya, esto está de sobre. Uh -huh. Take some time to prepare it. Or, may, or maybe to cook it. Así. Mm, toma algo, algo de tiempo o, o mucho tiempo. Mm, sí. Takes, takes, um, takes much, is, uh, takes much ahí, time. Ahí sí le podríamos agregar, ¿verdad? It takes... For more... It, it, for more uh, Sale una vez la que solo una vez al año se recoge ese, ese fruto, ¿verdad? Mm, pero yo creo que entraría aquí, en la primera. Ajá, sí, específica. Es que, que es limitado. O escaso. Vaya. Entonces, nos pasamos a las advantages. Pero tenemos que agregarle lo, lo, los comandos, esto, ¿verdad? De... Ah, sí, 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 es cierto. De fumor, ah, in addition. Eh, pero hagamos, la, hagamos las ideas y después acoplamos lo demás. Vaya, entonces, nos okay. pasamos a las ventajas. Uh -huh. okay. Aquí sí ya podemos hacer una como una edición, ¿verdad? Advantage. Uh -huh. Una ventaja es healthy food. Ajá. Sí, una healthy food. Y ese, y ese office que es 2000, es el, el más reciente. Es el dos, sí, el 2021. Ah, uh -huh. se mira bien, bien colocho. Sí, lo que pasa es que es el tema que lo he dejado en tema oscuro por eso, por la, por la vista. Bien probado. Sí, es que aquí yes. vamos a la vanguardia. Yes. Y apenas con, con Windows XP. No, pero no crean, lo, lo tengo chabeleado. Ah, bueno, pero igual está, está pro. Sí, así sí da gusto trabajar. Sí, cabal. It's a healthy food. Eh, quiero ver. Ah, eh, eh. Eh, recomendado I recommend for people eh, the over the overweight overweight sí es recomendado para las personas con sobrepeso verdad ah consumo de, de mm -hmm. ese producto Uh -huh. Sí. Eh, eh, nos quedamos con el healthy food, ¿no? Oh, bueno, I have a medicinal properties. Mix trombo. <ríe> Será. Rodrigo. Ah. Y le sugiere diseño, ¿verdad? Sí, 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 sí. Me sugiere diseño. Uh -huh. Bien. Hay unos diseños súper buenos que se ve así como que, que es una presentación bien elaborada. Sí, Teacher, ¿a dónde vamos a ubicar los? Furthermore, and whatever, in addition. 
Okay. Uh, so in this case, you are just identifying the disadvantages and advantages. Es lo yes. Que ahorita, ¿verdad? Yes, of course. Ajá. Pero si se fijan, ese no es un párrafo. Es como las ideas principales de las disadvantages and advantages. Entonces, mm -hmm. ¿qué es lo que van a hacer después de haber hecho esto? A armar el párrafo. El párrafo significa que van a ser las líneas unidas, las, las ideas unidas, unidas con las transitions word. Uh -huh. Transition word. Uh -huh. Ok. Otra idea. A ver, me dice el profe. Que es strange. Strange de memory. Fortaleza. Y fortaleza la memoria. Fortaleza la memoria. Eh, aquí voy a poner otro. Uh, easy. Digestion. Agradable, o sea, agradable o rico sabor y de fácil digestión. Uh -huh. Vale, uh -huh. hoy tenemos que hacer el... el... Las transition word. Párrafo, uh -huh. ¿eh? Gilberto, ¿y usted solo vende por mayor a las tiendas o también puede vender así como individuals si nosotros le, pide, le pedimos? Al menos debo. Dice teacher que yo lo que hago, como es poquito lo que saco, lo, lo pongo ahí en el puesto a vender por libritas o media libra o cuatro onzas. Ah. Como es, no me da para andarle ofreciendo a otros clientes. Pues, sí tengo clientes de mayoreo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Que le vendo ya con la compañía canela, pimienta, comino. Pero no, no específico con ese producto, ¿verdad? Como eso es extra, mi trabajo. Mm. ¿Y dónde tiene su puesto? En Santana. Oh, tenemos que ir hasta Santana. <ríe> Hay que ir hasta Santana. Voy a dónde el, por allá. ¿A dónde lo tiene, don Gilberto? En la terminal vieja de, de la Tudo, ¿verdad? Ah. Eh, se llama France. Por la... Por el mercado. Sí, el mercado Colón. Ajá, ah, ya. Yeah. La terminal Francisco Lara se llama esa terminal. Donde antes, antes llegaba la 201. Hoy, hoy no tiene su propia terminal. Uh -huh. La Tudo llegaba ya. Sí. Ah, ok. Ahí oh, de ahí sale la 276. Sí, correcto, que va para San Salvador, a Popa y a Popa, viceversa. A Sí. Ok. Y si le encargamos una libra, no la puede vender. <ríe> ¿Cómo lo podemos hacer la entrega? Ay, jale. Bueno, Vía... pero usted es de acá de San Salvador, ¿verdad? No, no, aquí de Ciudad. O sea, ahí me lo manden una 276 con el motorista. <ríe> <ríe> no, mentira. Al Ay, rato vamos. no. ¿Cómo es que se llaman estos, estos uh, drivers? Los deliveries. Uh -huh. um, pedido ya. <risa> Cabal, pedido ya. Ok, how many minutes extra do you need? Eh, maybe okay. ten. Ten minutes. Mm -hmm. Ok. That you can eat on uh, every moment of the day. In addition, oh. 
Hello, teacher. How many minutes extra do you need? Hi, 15. 15? Es que estamos ordenando la idea. Miss, okay. tengo una duda. Uh -huh. Fíjese que nosotros cuando hacemos grupos vocales, hacemos como, por ejemplo, directores aparte, docentes aparte, estudiantes aparte. Y cada uno tiene como edades eh, que se vinculan según ese lineamiento. Uh -huh. Pero en un grupo focal pueden ir de varias edades. Sí, el producto no? depende del producto. If uh -huh. this product is for different ages, yes, it, it can be. Entonces con Gaby decidimos poner como esto de las edades, como mayor de 12 años y menor de 60. Uh -huh. Ok. ¿Se puede? Yes. If that will be the population, right, that uh, will use the product, yes, you can do it. But, ok. But you can divide maybe the groups. You can say one group from 12 to 15. You can uh -huh. divide another group from 15 to 25. So uh -huh. you can divide it by age, ages. And you can see the like different results. At the end, it depends, it depends on the age. And then at the end, you can just um make a summary about the different ages. Miss. Mm -hmm. Entonces, cuando hablamos de grupos, porque yo ponía que la ventaja podría ser de que esto se podría probar en una sola sesión, pero no me garantiza que el hacer un grupo focal es una sola vez, ¿verdad? Porque entonces no, no sé. Um, lo podría hacer de una sola sesión, pero igual, si usted quiere, lo puede hacer diferentes sesiones o diferentes grupos. Mm. Porque la ventaja es que hemos puesto que, o sea, se puede hacer en una sola sesión y que el costo, el costo sería menor porque una sola salida, por ejemplo, si se les dan viáticos o cosas así, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. y, ajá, las actividades pueden ser variadas eh, para cada persona por las especificaciones que tiene y que la experiencia puede, va a ser como inolvidable. Y desventajas es que una sola vez no garantiza el, que el producto funcione. Uh -huh. No sé si están bien así. Desventaja sería que no garantiza que el producto Ajá. funcione. Ajá, es desventaja. Yes. Sí. Ahí depende su punto de vista, ¿verdad? Como usted quiera uh, enfocarlo. Hay que presentarlo en Canva, ¿verdad? Mm, mm, depende de su creatividad. ¿Ok? If you want to do it in Canva, it's ok. Tomorrow we are going to read the paragraph. ¿Ok? Ah, ok. Ay. Ah, pues sí. Sí, because we don't have, we don't have enough time. I will close the rooms at 9.55 para que hagamos una tarea que tenemos de esta clase. Okay. Faltando cinco. And then you can, if you haven't completed, so you can do it um, when you have time or tomorrow. We can, I can give you an extra minutes to to review it. Okay, teacher. Okay. okay miss. See you Thank at 9.55. Okay. Okay. Este, como como que reúne a todos los participantes, pero es una desventaja que si tiene solo personas chai, o sea, tímidos, este, puede que no, no haya muchos resultados porque nadie va a querer opinar. Uh -huh. O oh, no sean tan profundas las respuestas, sino que sea algo corta y no. Hello guys. Hello, teacher. I will give you five minutes extra. Um, if you don't complete it, 
no problem don't worry so you can do it later on or tomorrow we can i can give you extra time to do it but just you're going to present a paragraph remember okay no is no uh, recording just a paragraph just to check. Okay. okay see you okay. at 9 55 in the main section okay thanks okay, thanks you're working. What? Besides, he has two years of verify spelling in advantage. Uh, advantage mm -hmm. verify a spelling okay oh, let me see advantages okay add eh, la e hay que cambiar uh -huh. la, la la primera e advantages uh -huh. en vez de la e va a Advantages. Ese. Así. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Vamos a poner una más de. Ya yeah, falta. De ventajas. Una. Sí, falta una. Ah, uh, it. Besides, it has two years guarantee. Um. And he has uh, a lot of technology. It has a lot of uh, a lot of, of technology. Okay, this is advantages. Now, wait. Uh, the following chart is um, this disadvantage. This disadvantages. So, uh -huh, this. These advantages. Uh -huh. Ajá. Advantages. Ahí os lo póngale. En la otra le vamos a poner this más advantages. Sí. Ajá. Bye. Okay. Una de las desventajas que se me ocurre es que habría que posicionarlo en el mercado porque no, por tratarse de un nuevo dispositivo, Ajá. aún no está posicionado. Ajá, y también que hay pocos hay poco dispositivos en el mercado por ser un producto nuevo. Entonces, ¿cómo podríamos ponerlo? Eh... Hay pocos o no hay suficientes device en el mercado. There, there isn't, there isn't a no. Oh. There is an enough device in the market because it's a new product. Como es suficiente, enough, enough, verdad? Ajá. 
I know. There is no enough device. Yes. The business. No. ¿Cómo se escribe? Decir. Recibe. No, the the business. The business or device. At market. At the market. Or in the market. In the market. Okay. Because it's a new product. Okay. Ajá, y okay, la vamos a poner. Ajá, le vamos a poner las palabras de transición. ¿no? For the more. Uh -huh. Además, la que usted estaba diciendo. Es dos. To be. New product. Just to be. It is. No. Don't have it. No, este no está. ¿Cómo puedo poner que no está posicionado en el mercado? Es o no es conocido. It is mm. unknown. Um, no. No. Product in the market. No es reconocido en el mercado. Por ser un nuevo producto. Guys, I'm nuevo. going to close the session and you can complete it tomorrow, okay? Or if you have time later on, so you can do it. Oh my goodness, it's late. <laughs> yes, it is. I think it's nine o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is almost 10. I'm it's, going to close yeah. the rooms, okay? Okay. Okay, still waiting for the rest. Okay, everybody is back. Thank you so much. Okay, we're going to... um complete the activity tomorrow almost done i guess but we're going to complete that tomorrow so now please go to the to the homework the one that is let me see 2.8 Because of the time, I'm going to just present the answers. But if you have questions, please let me know. 2.8. Mm -hmm. 2.8. <clears throat> OK, just how are you going to ask uh, one by one to read them? Rodri Rodrigo, please help me to read the number one. Mm. 
I don't do it any 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 work of this two two point eight right mm -hmm. okay the first one he wanted to study in a university I say... this one is the correct the one that is selected ah let let me see ah as a result okay hey okay he went to study in a university as a result he went to Yale university last month okay good carlos please read number two yes and it was dreaming very fast yes for the reason the police gave him a ticket okay driving driving mm -hmm. okay, okay Gilberto please read number three Gilberto okay teacher uh, although Qatar is a small country it is very rich okay Good. Andres, number four. Jeddah is a big city where whereas where, where Jubil is a small city. Whereas. Mm -hmm. whereas. 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 Good. Robert, can you speak or no? Yes, teaching. Okay, number five. Number five, he plays tennis and football. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, one point. Oh. One point one, I guess this is. Okay. Um... Gabriela. Hi, teacher. Mm -hmm. The number one three. Four... Yeah, one again. I studied journalist in college. In addition, I had a part-time job at a newspaper. Okay. Studied journalism. Good. Number two, lady. I joined the guitar club. In the math club in school. Additionally, I went on a camping trip with the debate team. Debate team. Okay. Debate team. Guitar. Guitar. Yes. Okay. And number three would be smoking is a bad habit because it's, it smells bad and it can damage your health. Furthermore, it is a very expensive habit. Do you know that in the United States, companies make discounts uh, to people, to employees that doesn't smoke? If they smoke, they have to pay a lot for the health insurance. They pay, they pay more than someone that doesn't smoke pay. Like, Maybe a hundred dollars extra every month. Okay, number two. I'm sorry, number four. The politician is too old to be our pay our president. Moreover, he is not trustworthy. Number five. I like math, and I like science as well. Good. Do you have questions about this? This was mean trustworthy. Trustworthy. What is trust? Confianza, maybe. What is truth? Uh huh. No, it's confiable. But, uh, okay, trustworthy. Okay, thank you. Okay. Do you have questions? Any Any another question you may have? 
sorry that I'm taking more, more minutes. So if you don't have questions, that is everything for today. Well, thank you so much for your attendance and see you tomorrow at the same time, okay? See you tomorrow. Okay. Take care. See you. Thank you so night. much. Bye, teacher. Good night. Good Bye. night, teacher. Good night. Bye. Bye. Bye.